No, no. To one of my agents. He just started telling you just for general information purposes and uh, apparently there's some uh, vehicular contact, some uh, aggression there. So instead of giving you over to local police and letting them take care of it, it was a very serious offense. So we thought we'd just ask you a couple questions, see what was going on. We don't want to get anyone in trouble, but we just want to see, you know, a little information as well. If you've seen anybody, okay. and then we'll let you go free. All right. Would that be a good deal? Yeah, sure. I mean, sure. I don't know what it's about, but I can help you any way I can. Okay, so, well, Special Agent Stax received uh, a call, and he went, and it appears he may have given a little hit and run. But if you can cooperate and tell us any people you've seen up there, any sure. illegal activity, okay. areas, All right. we'll, we'll have to up the charges. Okay, cool. Basically first thing that happened up there was I was kidnapped and used as a hostage in a robbery. Second thing that happened was I had some guy in a black car pushing me off the road. I eventually basically disconnected. Couldn't figure out what... Anyway, it was a long story, but the point is people coming up behind me and reading my number plate out, that's like mafia activity. Well, to me it is anyway. I've seen it before. So on the way down here today what I basically did was as soon as I heard the guy calling out my number plate and getting really close I just like hit the brakes and then uh, smashed his radiator because then they can't chase me and take me hostage again and when you're in a mule you can't really get away Okay, now these mafia types, have you seen any in the city? Any gangs or anything? Any names you can give us? I don't know any of their names or numbers. All I know is that they sort of dress in black. They have black cars. So basically, I, to be honest, I just thought it was one of those guys when I ran the wheel. I, you know, because I did, I reversed into his car. Put it into a tree. And then basically drove off. And this isn't yeah, something that, that I would vehicle, normally do. Oh, this isn't something I would normally do, but... That was a vehicle but... with a special agent, though. Ah, that was right. special agent Stacks in that vehicle. Well, I apologize, but uh, that's a mistaken identity case here. I figured I was getting carjacked again. It usually happens Don't either worry, on the sir. way from the panning place or on the way from the refinery, so this is why I was looking for someone else when I came to there. I don't know if you were there. I came out with my flashlight to see what was going on. Okay, sir. Well, if you can give us some information on perhaps illegal areas up there. We've had a, had a couple of drug busts on a local farm, but you know any illegal areas up there we could uh, have a little look at? Um, I haven't been on the server that long to actually know who these people are. All I know is when I've got gold ore or gold, I'm getting targeted. Okay, okay, well... Are you I talking about that server over there? Yeah, are what? you saying you've been on our server? Yeah, just... Yeah, oh, sorry. In this city. Hold on. Special Agent Chen, is this related to that hacking case? It may be. It may be. So, do you undergo an online alias known as the Destroyer XX Quickscopes XX? He hacked into our database last month. Oh, no. I'm Drift Johnson, also known as Shogunate Tom. Okay, okay. Well, I think we got all that we need here. So, I don't know if uh, Special Agent uh, Danino or uh, Stax would like to say anything, but that's it from me. I got no more questions here. Not that I can think of, let's just uh, fingerprint him and send him on his way. I think that'd be best. What about you, Stax? Sounds good to me, man. Okay, if you'd like to make your way out of the room and into this uh, CCTV room, we'll get your fingerprints done, and then you'll be free to go, sir. We'll take you back to your van. Cheers. Okay, sir, if you'd like to stop at this uh, fridge-looking machine here, just put your hand in, and it's going to be a little razor, razor thing, scanning your hand. It's going to tickle a little bit, but it's going to be just fine. No harm or anything. 
You'll just be in the system. Hmm. So I'm getting my fingers printed. There we go. Left and right hand. Um. Just gonna check the system. Hmm. Okay. This is a bit random. I'm getting. Okay. Printed. Yeah, that's coming up nice and clear. Okay. Thank you very much. We're all done here. Well, we're certainly putting on a you show. would just like okay. to go down here, sir? Yeah, I think I got away with trashing that FBI car. Basically, I had a suspicion it might have been the cops, but I had no idea. No blue lights, no markings. i have been jacked before, so I just thought, well, what can you do? I got a big truck, so I'll wreck him <laughs> through the radiator, and it worked, but I got lucky. It's only because the damage on this server is, like, realistic, so, yeah. But, yeah, that was pretty funny. Should have got the beginning of it. They brought me here and everything. And I'm just like, oh, I'm not convinced you're the cops, man. And they're, they're the FBI dude. This is uh, Special Agent Chen of Central. Uh, we are our career uh, depositing uh, a registered suspect back to his vehicle. We're our career here. Madness. Okay, sir. Black if you'd like cars. to get in my vehicle, just down the way, I'll let you uh, I'll go back to your destination. Just like the mafia. I really do have place to go and people to meet. Special Agent Chen, would you like me to resume patrol? Roger that, Special Agent. I uh, you know a few stacks could resume uh, regular patrol and uh, we'll Loop. start finding this criminal. No way, they've got undercover black cops everywhere. Can I ask a question? Okay. Yeah, of course. Are these cars only for FIB members? Yeah, you're gonna need the FIB to, uh, to acquire this vehicle. Okay. Well, I'll try to look out in future. I must admit, I didn't recognize it. Yeah, it's understandable. They are stealth units, so we do have everything racked out. No siren, nothing like that. We are in undercover uniform. So, I can't blame you too much, it's understandable. Hmm. Well, sorry about the fuss. Oh, don't worry. It's been a slow day, you know, it's a bank holiday, so, uh... I'll get a tow truck out there. Um, it's been a little, uh, a little quiet today. I didn't even know there was FIB. I thought it was just cops, ambulance, you know? Oh, you learn something every day. Yeah, yeah, it's very secretive. We don't even advertise ourselves anywhere. It's so uh, under the radar. Like, uh, it's sort of a on, a on an invite basis. That's the way it works. Right. I must admit, when I first saw the black car coming that was tailing me, I, I, I thought he was trying to snipe me. Oh, you don't gotta worry about that, sir. You're not gonna do that. We're here to protect you from those sort of people. If anybody ever tries to, you know, do something that is big, that, you know, isn't perhaps what the local police are here for, you know? Terrorism, uh, chaos, that sort of thing. Give us a call. Okay. Well, thank you very much. Okay, I got another call. Take it easy. Safe journey. There you have it. 
5M Ultimate RP. I just got arrested by the feds! The feds! I wish I was streaming when... See, that's my bad for not streaming the whole thing. Basically, I was leaving the gold area and a black car came up behind me and started reading, in, reading out my license plate and I thought, oh great, now the Mafia is going to be after my truck of gold. So, I did the only thing I could and I slammed on the brakes suddenly, he rammed into me and there's realistic damage in this game, in this mod, so you take a few hits to the front of the car like that and you're done. So I just reversed into him down the hill, totaled the car, and drove away. <laughs> Thing is, if I'm a gold merchant, I'm only coming to one place, here. So when I got here, I parked up, locked the, locked the truck, got out, got my flashlight. Did they take my flashlight? No, I've got my flashlight, yeah. And, um, and what happened was, um, there was like two two black cars waiting for me. I was like, oh great, this is where, this is the end of the line. This is where I uh, run out of luck. And uh, no owned vehicle nearby. Oh no! Oh.